Hello, I'm Hannah, and this is Samson. And today we are going to talk a little bit about snakes and try to just make them seem maybe a little less scary because they're really not all that bad. So as I mentioned before, this is Samson. Samson is about six and a half or seven years old. Um, corn snakes can live anywhere between like 10 to 20 years, depending. So hopefully he'll have a good long life. He's about three and a half to four feet. As you can see, he's a very wiggly noodle. So it's pretty hard to get him to stay still and straight enough for a tape measure, but he's about three and a half to four feet. Samson is a corn snake and corn snakes are not native to Cook County, Illinois. They are in fact native to the southeastern United States. However, they are in the family of snakes known as colubrids. Like most of the snakes that you will find commonly in Cook County and in the forest preserves. So snakes in the family Colubridae, or Colubridae, or however you want to pronounce it, all share a few features. They have small, rounder heads and these very round eyes with round pupils, and they lack any rattle on their tail. They lack those heat sensing pits at the fronts of their faces. Some colubrids give live birth, others lay eggs. They have specialized scales that all snakes have on their belly. You can see Samson's are fun. They kind of look like Indian corn or piano keys, checkerboards, and those are his scoots. And those are especially wide scales that help him move on the forest floor or through the grass because he moves his body sort of like an accordion or a slinky sort of expanding and contracting his muscles. And then he can use those flat scoots to help him sort of scoot along. You can also remember that the belly scales are called scoots because they're cute and cute rhymes with scoot, and look how cute he is. So, you may be wondering, why, are, why do snakes even matter? Are they just around to scare you? No. Snakes are a very important part of the ecosystem because they provide a free form of pest control, which can be especially important for agricultural purposes, but it's also important in our native ecosystems in the forest preserves because they prevent small animals like mice and voles from over predating any of our native plant species. Additionally, snakes are super important because they provide an important food source for larger predators like red-tailed hawks, great blue herons, raccoons. There's lots of other animals that benefit by snacking on these guys. So even if you don't like snakes, something you might be a little more affectionate towards or familiar with, might need snakes to, to eat. So that's Samson. And of course, as always, I never recommend and is highly unrecommended to attempt to handle wildlife leave them be. They'll leave you alone if you leave them alone. They'll probably try and get away from you as fast as they can. But Samson here, he likes to be out. So I hope this has made you feel a little bit better about snakes in the forest preserves.